Conservative to me, peeps, what's up? It's me, John David Little. Hey, we're talking about alternative energy right now, solar power. The United States just broke a record today for developing the size of these power plants, and it's really fantastic. It was done by a California company, and check this out. That uh, in, right outside, in, in Boulder City, Nevada, about 40 miles, you know, around uh, Las Vegas there, uh, there were, they constructed a 48 megawatt solar panel facility. This is the photovoltaic type of solar power plant. It is the largest in the United States right now. It broke the previous record holder of a 20 megawatt facility that was over in Florida. And it's really very interesting. It, they're starting to develop this. But here's the other cool thing. The United States has the world's largest solar thermal power plant that basically takes some solar rays, heats up a fluid, which is then used for hydrox to generate electricity and whatnot. That's very, very powerful. That can uh, send electricity and power about half a million homes, which is fantastic. This one that was constructed, that was constructed outside of Las Vegas can uh, power around 14,000 homes. That's pretty good. But the same company, the same California company uh, that is doing, that, that just broke this U.S. record is now also has the approval, I believe, to do a 200 megawatt solar power firm, uh, farm in California. And they also are working on trying to construct a 600 megawatt solar facility. Uh, later over there in Arizona. I mean, this is really interesting. It's very powerful. Uh, the United States now is looking to take a strong lead in alternative energy. What do you think about this? Do you think that solar power is ready? Do you think that it's, it's, it's here to stay now? Where do you think that the United States will be in terms of other countries, in terms of leading the way? And how much can this back us off of the fossil fuels like oil and coal? And what impact will that have on oil exporting countries such as Saudi Arabia and others? Of course, we get most of our coal and natural gas from right here at home in the United States. But I want to know from you, what do you think about this story? And what do you make of this new advance in clean energy from the United States? Comments below, subscribe above. I'm John D. Villarreal, and you're watching Conservative New Media.